Hello, my dear students. Welcome to IMS Gate Academy. Myself, Sandeep Padari. Now, my dear students, Gate notification has been released. Now, in this video, I would like to cover what are the best combination of two purpose. Now, I would like to tell you how much coverage is the intersection between the respective question paper or you can say respective primary paper and second paper. And what are the advantages in attempting the second paper and for which branch, which is the best opted second paper, I would like to discuss in this video. Now, coming to the branches, my dear students. Now, we have civil engineering. In civil engineering, the primary paper is civil engineering. The secondary paper can be agricultural engineering or you can say architectural engineering or you can say aerospace engineering or XC paper or geomatics or naval architecture and you have environmental science. Out of these papers, which is the best branch, we will discuss in the later slides. Similarly, for mechanical, you can apply for aerospace, uh, data science or instrumentation, uh, naval architecture, production and XC. Similarly, for ECE, see my dear students, computer science, DA, triple E, instrumentation and physics. For electrical, DA, EC, instrumentation and physics. Similarly, for CS, DA, EC, GE, mass, physics and statistics. Now, my dear students, if you see, these are the branch codes. Suppose, aerospace engineering AE, agriculture engineering AG, architecture AR, we have biomedical BM, biotechnology BT, civil engineering. These are all the branch codes, my dear students. Similarly, we have the other branch codes. So, now, my dear students, see, these are the XC sections, my dear students. We have fluid mechanics, material science, solid mechanics, thermodynamics, polymer science, food technology, atmospheric and oceanographic sciences. And we have engineering mathematics. Now, my dear students, first of all, we will consider civil engineering. If I consider civil engineering, my dear students, what will be the best option? Now, my dear students, when I talk about civil engineering, the best option according to me is the XC paper. Why? Because if you consider XC paper, my dear students, in XC paper here, if you see, there are two subjects like you have to consider fluid mechanics and solid mechanics. Now, with along with the gate preparation, like engineering maths and aptitude will be quite common for XC paper as well as for civil engineering. These are the two subjects where you can cover exactly with the civil engineering. There is no need of uh, discussing the subjects extra apart from the civil engineering primary paper. What I would like to tell you is, if you opt for XC paper, there is no extra means no extra focus required because whatever you do the preparation for civil engineering that will be 100% sufficient. But if you consider environmental science or if I consider geomatics, anyhow agricultural, naval architecture, aerospace is completely ruled off because they are completely new branch. So if you want to prepare that you can attempt only one paper among those but it is completely new. So, and one more thing, my dear students, attempting too many papers all make you trouble in the primary paper also. So, you should be focused. That is the reason if you select XC paper and select the subjects fluid mechanics and solid mechanics, that will be exactly same as the CE paper what you have done. Now, coming to environmental science and geomatics, almost 70% extra syllabus you have to take care. So, in this way, once you start preparing for the second paper also, you have to balance the primary paper. So, my dear students, whenever you are writing civil engineering, XC paper is the best option. Now, similarly, if I talk about the mechanical engineering. Now, in mechanical engineering, my dear students, you can choose XC paper or you have the other option is production. Why you can choose XC paper here, my dear students? In mechanical, you can choose either material science also or thermodynamics you have. So, these are the additional papers. In civil, you can select only fluid mechanics and solid mechanics. But for mechanical students, XC paper, they can start selecting material science and thermal because it is also same as the primary paper for mechanical. So, here, if you start preparing for XC for mechanical, the syllabus is same for primary and secondary. But for production, 
70 percent of the syllabus is safe if you consider manufacturing the syllabus for mechanical and production is almost safe but C and my dear students if you consider engineering mathematics also the syllabus is same for production and mechanical but there is one IM and oral is also common for mechanical and production but one subject is additional in production that is quality and reliability so you need some extra 30 percent if you see in production the 30 percent extra syllabus you have to take so my dear students let us consider for civil engineering what is the best option for second paper is XC paper if they are choosing fluid mechanics and solid mechanics you can attempt environmental science or geometrics also but you need 70 percent of extra efforts now coming to mechanical XC is also best best option in addition to this production is also a best option because only 30 percent of the extra focus you have to do now coming to the EC branch now my dear students if I consider ECE the best second option is instrumentation what is the best option sir instrumentation why because in instrumentation almost all the subjects control systems analog or EDC all the topics are same except in ECE you have to do some uh, additional things like one topic is measurements you have to do extra preparation for measurements topic and also we have optical instrumentation and industrial instrumentation which will be covered in sensors so what are the see 80 percent of the syllabus for ec and instrumentation is almost same 20 percent is more for ec option what is the 20 percent more syllabus is one is the measurements other one is the industrial instrumentation and optical instrumentation so here if you consider you need some 20 percent extra effort now my dear students some of the students in general they are very passionate in computer science engineering and they are studying BTEC in the electronics branch but now if you are writing CS paper or if you are writing DA paper then I will discuss what are the common topics in CS and DA and remember my dear students if I my sincere guidance if you are applying for CS as an electrical primary student or an electronic student definitely you should give only one paper in that case if you are writing EC paper then you can go for instrumentation if you are exclusively preparing for CS then I would say give the first primary paper itself as CS because standing on two platforms like one on EC and completely on other platform CSC it will mess up so that is the reason in this case either select EC or CS paper but if you are EC paper you are still want to write the secondary paper then instrumentation is the best option because 80 percent of the syllabus is same and you have to take additional care for the instrumentation like a measurements topic and optical instrumentation and industrial instrumentation now my dear students similarly if i talk about electrical so in electrical engineering my dear students here also 80 percent is same so here my dear students 80 percent of the syllabus is same and you can opt for instrumentation for electrical students also the best second option is the instrumentation my dear students why instrumentation let us tell. see if you see control systems signal systems or if you consider digital or analog all the subjects are common in electrical and instrumentation one additional topics are there that is the communication topic is additional topic for electrical students who are writing for instrumentation in addition to this optical instrumentation as well as industrial instrumentation and sensors or the additional topics that is the reason 80 percent of the syllabus is same now my dear students the same thing I am going to tell if you are writing CS paper or DA paper for electrical make it as a primary paper and apply don't try to stand on two papers CS as well as electrical because those two are very different verticals in this short time in six or eight months if you want to give primary paper I would say triple e is the best option if your primary BTEC is electrical engineering still if you want to prepare for computer science then only write the computer science that will help you now coming to the most important branch that is the computer science now my dear students see if you see in computer science almost you can the best option is DA data data science and artificial intelligence when I consider data science and artificial intelligence if you talk about the common subjects in computer science programming is there in data science also programming is there 
data structures is common for cs and uh, as well as data science and artificial intelligence or algorithms is also common and if you see database management is also quite common but when coming to data science and artificial intelligence mathematics related to statistics it is more focused and remembering we have additional topics like warehousing we have additional topics like warehousing is also an additional topic in addition to this my dear students there is also additional topic related to machine learning so if you say in a scale of 100 60 40 i can say 60 percent of the syllabus is common with computer science and data art, data science and artificial intelligence but for cs students data science and artificial intelligence is the best option so let me conclude for civil engineering the best option is xe because the syllabus is almost same for mechanical i would say xe paper you can select thermal material science fluid mechanics or solid mechanics and you can choose the best option is also production for electrical and ec electronic students instrumentation is the best option and if you still want to write computer science make it the primary paper as computer science only for computer science students data science and artificial intelligence is the best option because there are four to five common subjects like programming data structures algorithm database management database management and also some of the topics are common in mathematics i hope in this video the best combination of two papers are clear for you now what we do at ims gate academy we at ims gate academy are offering all india mock test series around 12 mock test series have been released and you can this will be a as if the gate experience and gate environment will be provided in this test series so using this test series we are also providing the gate question booklet which covers 33 years of solutions and see students if you want to enroll only for the test series it is 1770 rupees the post gate guidance can also be given but if you want to enroll for previous year gate questions subject test all india mock test the pricing is 3299 now similarly my dear students what we do at ims gate academy we at ms gate academy offers 800 plus hours of gate coaching we provide offline gate coaching at bangalore and also at vijayawada we are providing the subject wide test multiple subject test advanced level test the key success for the ims students enrolled students is the one to one mentorship here we will be covering the post gate guidance psu opportunities let me tell you the final important point even though you are selecting the second paper you can be eligible only for mtech in iits or iscs psus will consider only the primary paper they will never consider the because whatever the primary paper means whatever you have done your specialization in btech that gate score will be valid for psus the secondary paper will not be considered for psus i hope this video will help you in understanding or opting the best option for of the two papers for the respective branches thank you Thank you.